Hi folks, this is Rob from SmokingPit.com and I got here the Maverick ET732. Uh, this is the uh, wireless uh, digital thermometer that I've been showing on my site. It's a great uh, little uh, tool here for, for barbecuing. Um, I'm going to show you in this video is actually is, is how, how to set this thing up for the, to set the thresholds for low temp and high temp for, for the cooker and for uh, the meat. Now, I'll be using this in the smoke today, doing some ribs, um, so I won't really be using the, the, the temp probe, but we'll be using it for monitoring the, the cooker. So, uh, that said, uh, we'll go ahead and get started, and I'll show you exactly how to, set, how to configure this thing. So what we're going to do first is power the units on. So, you want to hold down the power button on the remote, and then we'll turn on the transmitter. And then you want the reason you turn the, the the remote on first is this will send out a signal the transmitter you'll see a link up which we did and that's that second beepy here and you can see it transmitting right there you can see a little uh, let me see if I can get a better shot of it you'll see a little uh, what looks like a satellite dish coming on here pretty soon there you go so you see we have a link now what we'll do is when we plug in the temp gauge into the side for the cooker it's going to start sending data. Now what I'm going to do is show you how to set the thresholds. We're going to go ahead and unplug the grill temp probe because we don't want it going off until the thing warms up. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to take the barbecue, the, these two buttons right here will set the barbecue temp. So we're going to go, the top one is for high and low, so we're going to set the low temp, we're going to hold it until it starts flashing. Okay, and then we're going to go ahead and increment up and we'll go ahead and set it, I like to set it for about 160 degrees, 150 degrees. And that's going to store it, so it's stored as 150. So that's going to be the low threshold. If it gets below 150, it'll um, sound an alarm. If you want to see what that threshold is, you just hit the button again, it'll display it. Now we're going to set the upper threshold for the barbecue. By pushing the top button, we'll do the same thing. We'll hold it down. I've already got it stored in here from the last time, but I'll show, take, go ahead and take you through it. So we're going to have to go past. And I'll just say 249. So there we go, hit the mode button and it's stored. So if the cooker goes above 249, I'm going to get an alarm. And I can go ahead and recall these. There's the low, there's the upper. If I was going to do meat, the high temp for my meat, I would come up here. You can see I have it preset for 169. Um, if, that's what I use for chicken. So again, you, you hold it down, hold it until it flashes and then start holding it down. You can see you can increment it and I'll set it for something like a pork butt. I'll, you know, maybe I want to take them up to 205 like so. Hit mode and it's saved. So now I have my low preset for the, for the cooker, my threshold. I have my upper threshold for the cooker and I have my alarm set for, for my uh, food product. So when any one of these are meet, these three conditions, we'll get an alarm. So it kind of keeps you from ending up with your, you know, your temp running away on your cooker or you, you overcooking your uh, chicken like I've done on many occasions because I get too busy. So in a nutshell, that's it. Um, other than that, you uh, just plug in the, the probe, put it on your grate, and I'll show you that in a second. And we'll uh, show you how the display looks. Now we're going to go ahead and uh, we'll hook up our... Uh, barbecue probe to monitor the uh, smoker and we'll place the probe inside the smoker at a great level. You can see I got some uh, nice looking ribs there. Uh, I got a video coming up on that one too. That's kind of uh, how it works. 
again it's the uh, Maverick Ready Check ET732. It's a, a great dev device. It's raining out here. It's a water resistant. Um, so uh, great range. I've got a couple videos up right now that kind of explain what it does and, and uh, um, the unboxing and all that too. So go check out my site, smokingpit.com. These, these videos are now available on iTunes as well. So uh, all my videos are now coming up on iTunes. So you folks have a great day. Again, this is the Maverick. Ready check ET732.